This is a video review of the Bemis Slow Close Toilet Seat. First I wanted to show you the toilet seat that I replaced and the reason I replaced it. So you can see the mechanism here is very similar to what you're going to see on the Bemis. There's a long plastic screw that goes in through the seat, into through the toilet rather, with a small little flange on the bottom that keeps it from turning. And at the top there's a little hex head, or sorry, a little Phillips head here that you drive in. You can see that the head here started to thread out and I couldn't get the toilet seat to stay as tightened. It kept coming loose over and over again. Uh, anyway, so that's one of the reasons I decided to replace it. And it was also a very loose hinge and it would slam late at night, waking other people up. So I decided to pick the Bemis for those couple of reasons. Let me show you exactly what I mean. So first, let me show you one of the primary things about the Bemis is the slow close. I'm just letting it close on its own right now. It will close and it'll come down, but very gently. Uh, it's both opening the top and the whole seat, as you can see. Both of them go down very gently. And let me show you the final piece that I wanted to show you. I can move the camera a little bit right now to get right over top of the seat. And that's back here in the hinges. As you'll see, let me open up the flap in the back here. There's actually a one half inch uh, nut on the top here. It does have the Phillips head, uh, Phillips head screw here as well, so you can use that if you have to. But using a uh, using a, a wrench, especially a socketed wrench, a ra ratcheting wrench, makes it really easy and quick to tighten these up. And as you can see, I'm going to shake the whole lid right now, and it's not moving at all. It's extremely tight. I think they call these stay locks. And one of the interesting aspects of these, uh, as you're putting them in, these pieces actually pop off. So there's one hex that's on there that breaks right off as you're putting this in. And then there's a second one sunk down in there so that this can close. And uh, once that's all in place, uh, it has a little flexibility in terms of where you can put it. I didn't try to use any of that at all because it's pretty much exactly where I wanted it. So I just put it in like that, no problem. I've uh, been really happy with it. Um, holds itself in place very well. Very nice seat. Looks great, of course. Uh, looks better than the cheap generic one that I had before. Yeah, that's all for now. It's a good seat. Uh, I hope you consider it. Thank you.